something weird going on in this room. Hello everyone, my name is Veritas and welcome back to Skyrim. There is, uh, I believe an orb of Magnus. Look at that. I never imagined this thing is immune, can't be killed, it doesn't have attack. Is it, why is it immune to everything? Does magic hurt it? I don't know. You're right, nothing does seem to work. Uh, do we have a paralyzed? <laughs> Jesus. Um, I'm gonna pass him some stone flesh. Carjo, quit attacking the damn thing. It's it. This is ridiculous. Ba ba da bum, ba ba dum, ha ba dum, hum ba bum. Now attack it. I. I'm out of fire. It doesn't really hurt. We need to get some fire on this axe, though. Or this bow. Uh, pause the world. I'm glad that that's instantaneous and not, it doesn't. It doesn't. A resisted fire damage. Oh. Good. Resisted fire damage. It's dead. It is dead. It's so dead. Okay. That's not. Uh, that's. That's just unnecessary. Ah, I feel like I just woke from a nap. What, did you, what are you doing down there, bud? What kind of fucking death magic you got going on? The fuck is happening in this place? The writ of sealing. Can't. Oh, this is Forbidden Legend. Okay. Um, okay. Be bound here. Uric, murderer, betrayer. Condemned by your crimes against the realm and lord, may your name and your deeds be forgotten forever, and the charm which you bear be sealed by our ward. Welp. Fucked something up. It's no longer sealed. Hi, Tolf dear. What's going on, bud? Is there a chest down here? Is there a... What's going on? Why are there fucking... Sorry, I had to check a text message. Cat and I are talking about playing some games later. Some games spelled G-A-Y-M-S because we are homosexual and I have tasted his semen. <laughs> this, this shit you shouldn't say. This the shit you shouldn't. What's going on with this thing? Touch. This is the Orb of Magnus, isn't it? It's, it's very pretty. Very pretty. This is making a very expensive anal bead. What's going on? What could this place be? I have no idea. You don't? This is amazing. Absolutely amazing. The Archmage needs to be informed immediately. He how did... This for how is this not being sensed by eyes. anything? Can you return to the college and inform Savo Sauron of this discovery? Sure. Please, hurry. I can do that for you. So how did no one know this was down here? I'm assuming the ward was, like, protecting it or some shit, this but... Is simply fascinating. Let's get a, let's get a group picture, Carjo. Not you, Teltier. There we go, group picture. Excellent. Um, is that it? I thought there would be a chest in here, or is it in the next room? Is this just an iron door, or is this a... It's an iron door, so there should be a chest in this room, then, if that is the case. Uh... You know, I don't know how people are going to react. I really don't have a, a huge uh, following at the moment, so... Ooh! Uh, me saying things like, Carjo, I want to get in bed with you, and... Things like that. I don't really have a frame of reference for if people know that I'm joking when I say that. I find that stuff to be fun. I, I like joking about that kind of stuff. My my humor is based in, in sexual. Really, that's... Okay, we're just going to go ahead and ignore that that door is literally at the beginning of the thing. And anyone that could... You could have just come in and broken down that goddamn door and boom. I am Agnes. But yeah, that, that stupid thing was two feet from the entrance. I heavily doubt that that was appropriate. Whatever. It's fine. It's it's always the same thing with Skyrim. You put the fucking the, the the crazy evil death ball that controls all of time and space is put two feet behind an iron door that could be easily broken down by someone who's just tapping on it for too long. Wearing the bars thin, ridiculous nonsense. But I'm excited because Cat is. We are in the talks of uh, having a little bit of a play date later, which. I don't know why people call when they take like their toddler over to like another toddler's house. They're like, it's, it's a play date. It's like that. If you say that to adults, that's sexual. Like, hundred percent of the time, a play date is a sexual thing. It has to be, right? Like, if you if if you go to a friend's house for a play date, you're gonna be fucking. I mean, there's really no way around that. 
there's 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 some buts, but there's no ifs or ands. You know what I'm saying? It's just there's there's gonna be sex involved, and probably lots of it if you're calling it a play date. But you know, who, who the fuck am I to, what to you question? Here, well, it's no. Ah, please don't tell me that another one of the apprentices has been incinerated. I have enough. To I see. I trust that Tolfdir will pro Thank you. Tolfdir normally looks after you. Since he's apparently occupied, and I will need to see this discovery for my. Speak with Urog in the Arcanium. See if he's aware. And good work. The next time you find yourself exploring Nordic ruins, perhaps this will be helpful. Cool. Thank you. I like how you talk down to me like I'm worse than you. At the end of the day, I'm going to be the fucking college of person guy, and you're going to be the not college of person guy, asshole. Where the fuck is this door? No, down here. Do, 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 Arcanium. Do, 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 do. Arcanium. All right. Hey, uh, Ustengrab, or whatever the hell your name was. Hey, Bilgriff. I you are now in the Arcanium. Of which I am in charge. It might as well be my own little plane of oblivion. Disrupt Fair enough. my arcanium, and I will have you torn apart by angry Atronox. Now, do you require assistance? Mmm. Yes. I know what you want. We're well, you don't even need to ask. No, I don't have anything. I said not anymore. Orthorn stole a number of books when he ran off to Felglow Keep to join those summoners. Some kind of peace offering. I think one of those volumes may have had some relevant information. If you want them, you'll have to talk to Orthorn. Let's just call it a... They were interested in research that goes outside the bounds of what the college allows. All right, then. they were persuaded to leave. Mm. As a matter of fact, they're... Immensely powerful. Nope, haven't heard of it. Himself up in Labyrinth. Nope. Since then, not doing it. I refuse. Of more of his work having turned up. If you can track it down, it may prove useful. I refuse to, to do anything. Oh. <sighs> yes. You there? I have questions for you. I'm sure you do, Ancano. You were in Sarfo, yes. Yes. It has come to my attention that something was found there. Congratulations. I am well aware. Tolfdir is still in Sarthol, is he? I shall be expecting a full report from him. Something was discovered in Sarthol that was significant enough that Tolfdir sent a new member of the college alone to deliver word. That sounds precisely like the sort of thing that should matter to everyone, mm. especially me. Especially Thank you for your help. You're, you may go now. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> My nose can only be upturned so much before it sounds like grunting from sexual intercourse. What a pointy ear bitch. <laughs> that guy's a bit of a cunt. He's a bit of a cunt. Fuck him. Because that's what you do to cunts, you fuck him. Literally. You put your penis in the vagina and that's how babies are made, as far as I'm aware. Jay, uh, are babies made when you pee inside of the woman? No. People fuck. I hate <laughs> the internet is a weird place. What's going on here? What are we doing? What's the uh, what's the objectivo? What menu is it? This one. All right. What is what is our objective? Find the stolen books. Oh, where is that at? Hmm. Hmm. What's our inventory looking like? Because I feel like we're getting full. Yeah, we're we're almost full. We're full of goodness. We're full of Carjo, if you know what I mean. Uh, take 25, targets takes 25 points of damage, twice as much magic damage, so 50. I only think that needs to be said in such a condescending way. It's like, if the target takes 18 damage, and he takes double magic damage, how much damage does the target take for magic? It's like, shut up. If the target has 45 watermelons, and Cindy has 3 watermelons, and they get into a car accident, and everyone involved dies... How many watermelons could possibly survive the car crash with the with the fucking velocity of a hundred, or some shit? Knowing the tangent ability for watermelons to withstand a fatal crash at seventy-five miles per hour, how many of Cindy's bones would be broken along the back side of the car? I, who needs to know these things? Why are we Why are we assisting mass murderers with getting away with crime? Also, chess piece. So. 
I would wear this, but I think robes are the one thing I actually have. Yeah, carrying capacity increased by 20. Uh, 32 armor, 7 weight, versus these robes, um, which have more weight, or less weight, more armor, but they are not enchanted with any kind of carry weight. In fact, I think I'd be over encumbered if I put them on. I am. Uh, as much as I like something that isn't this armor, uh, I'm not going to be able to wear it. So, I don't know. That's, that's unfortunate. I'm going to hold on to it, though, just because it might as well. Also, I need to get rid of this, ameth this amulet. What amulet was I wearing before? Um, increase your magicka. Uh, was I wearing this? I wasn't wearing that. What the fuck was I wearing before? I know I had one on. It was, oh, it was like the frost resistance thing, wasn't it? Where is that? Spells, that, that's not a fucking thing. This, this. Increase your frost resistance by 30%. Yeah, that's helpful, actually. That might actually be saving my life more than I, more than I realize that is. Um, staff of made light. It's not helpful at all. Elven mace. I can't get that to Karja because he'll fucking use it. So I guess we're gonna go find books. I suppose. I don't think we really need to go and sell anything per se, but I don't think so. Let's. I. Don't... We're just heavy for like no reason. I'm gonna give Karjo this armor. You are taking us some. What do you have? I will shoulder some of your burden. What do you have in here that's heavy? And not really anything. Okay, I'm gonna give you stuff then. I can't give you anything you'll use, though. <laughs> like any mace, like any of the stabs, because you'll fucking use them for some reason. Uh, have this, and those, and anything that weighs anything, really. Just take it. Those don't weigh much. If I give you Vulcoon, you're gonna wear it, so I can't give you Vulcoon. Um, I, th I think we weigh less enough now. Let's go do that now. Uh, which is where? It's somewhere. It's over by White Run, actually. Jeez. Um, what would be the best way to get there? I'm thinking here and go up the mountain, or here and go up. That looks like more of a mountain. Let's go to Shimmer Mist Cave and then head up. But we'll do that in the next part. So, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. We're going to head to that thing in the next episode. And yeah, this is probably going to be the last episode I record in this session, probably. Maybe. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, in the next part, we'll talk about giving Karjo head again. Or more of that. I don't know. Leave a comment about who your favorite Khajiit is to fuck. <laughs> and I will see you guys in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, until next time.